What's up, YouTube? I'm back with another one. Hey, man, we out here at the Fort Lauderdale Hurricanes Park, man. I'm out here, but to check check out Big Zip 'em Up. We ain't even gonna call them Zip 'em Up no more. We gonna call them Big Zip 'em Up. You feel me? We gonna call them Big Zip 'em Up. The number one team, number one 12 youth in the nation, and that's without a doubt. I don't care what you say. Zip them up is the number one 12 youth team in the nation. Knocking off Limbo last year, taking their crown, winning the YNC. They could have won whatever tournament they was in last year. That's how hot they was. So I'm out here to check them out to see what they got coming back. They added on a couple more pieces. You feel me? So number one team in the nation. Big zip them up. Let's go. Stop jumping, boy. Stop jumping. Good ball. Can you give me that? Oh, send him. Send him. One, two, three. One, two, three. Clap it up. Get him up, man. Get him up, get him up, get him up. Get him up. that fucking Ray put up. The edits, bro. We was coming off the ball too soft. We wasn't moving our hands and we weren't shooting our feet. The same shit we've been doing for months over there. This is where it all comes together. I didn't like none of that and we're too aggressive. We had one good play. Dread was somewhat almost the only most consistent lineman we had on Saturday. And even he was getting fucked up on some of them. Because you guys are forgetting your fundamentals. Cam, you big, but you got to get way more aggressive, my boy. That shit was coming off sweeter than a bitch. Sweet tarts. And I know we fucking better than that. So from this fucking point, I'm telling you, bro, we got to get more aggressive because we too big to be that doing that soft shit. Griff, it shouldn't take a nigga for them niggas to be like calling your, your mama name. Slapping the shit at you for you to get angry, should bro. It shouldn't be real. doing that. Yeah. You should be coming off. You playing K, you playing K Junior when I'm I mean RJ one of our toughest D lines. If he leaving his man, you gotta get him. What's the key? Block what? Inside Block. out. Don't forget yeah. the keys, man. That's even that time. Hello. Go. Hey, Sam, get ready. Stop that right a little bit. Yeah. If you're waiting on David, you gotta attack. Hey, 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 hey,
That's the shit I was just saying about over here. You coming right in front of me. Don't waste that shit. You know. You got to move on. You too big to be letting these little niggas hit you head up, KJ. No. If you sit here, bro, listen. Look, the difference between, look. If you sit here. Why you get the hill? waiting. Now the nigga coming too full. As tall as I am. I ain't in here. Now, if you step in the motherfucking hole and take the block on, now the running back gonna make a choice. He gonna cut back. You taking away the running lane, baby. You know what I mean? Take the block on. Come on, man, just cause it's a bitch, you know, take that you know, shit off no matter who it is, bro. You know the difference between the fullback and the running back? Thank you, so take on the block. You smart, you know it. That's it, bro. Hey, come on. Hey, hey, come on. Hey, come on. Hey, hey, come on. Hey, come on. Hey, come on. Hey, come on. Next to you, bump out, he, he tells you got a free speed yeah, rush right there. That's a kill shot. If you come out that, when you see all that shit clear out, you got that free shot. That's a free shot. So when you get down, you pop on you. Bro, you a killer nigga right there. You got a killer nigga right there. Them the ooh hits, bro. I like the ooh hits. You, you ain't never had the ooh hits. All that, that shit don't sound good. You know what sound good? When you smack the nigga ass in the whole crowd. Oh, Pete. That was you. Pete, you said the dog fits on that beat? Okay. Get down, boy. Bump down. Down. Up to the middle. So by you going this way and you already off, off your rocket, you off pursuit. I still cut right back off your ass now, you feel me? Nobody done now. You would have one line back on them. Sit that nigga on the plate. So you can't overrule the Everybody being greedy. You can't just see it. You gotta read, that's what your read step for. Now you're looking for the spot. Don't over pursue, don't over pursue. Stay home, read. You're the only line back. Other niggas went to the plate, man. Get over, oh. Get over, oh.
on the first time, they don't need none of the coaches. I don't know no 12-year-old kids that don't got to go through repetition. Reps, 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 reps. God, what I can't take is saying the same thing over and over and over. That's not reps. That's stupidity. That's insanity. That's me thinking that you're not hearing me and you're not gonna change when I tell you to do something different. I'm gonna give you one gem before I go and I promise to God on this, you better hear me clearly. The difference in last year team and this year team is, I'm not gonna beg you to do it. This is close as I done been to high school in a long time. Next man up, do you understand me? I don't think you hear me. Next man up, starters, starters from last year, to lose their job to a kid that's listening and working harder than them. I promise you this. Everybody keep telling me both ways. I'm practicing you both ways. You think I'm gonna let everybody go both ways? So what happens if you lose your starring job? Guess where you go to? The bench. Y'all do know that's football, right? Think I'm gonna feel sorry for you? No. Think your mom and your daddy can come talk to me and say, my baby played last year on the national team and now he's sitting the bench? What you think I'm gonna tell him? He asked. Your baby done fell off. Your baby don't wanna work hard for no more. I tell your baby 10 times what to do and he is not doing it. So let this be your warning, guys. Second day in pass. Some of us not listening. Some of us got this dumbass stare in our eyes like what Coach said going in this here and it's just floating in mid air and it's not comprehending anything. I'll, fair is fair, football is football. Keep thinking about what you did last year gonna help you get somewhat this year, you're gonna be sitting the bench. Do everybody understand me on that? We sure on that, right? Coach ain't known for lying to you boys. I love you all to death, but I'll be damned if I let a person that's working harder than you sit the bench because I love you more than him. I love all y'all the same, but what? I love everybody the same, I swear on that. So with that being said, I don't want to see your fake ass tears. I don't want to see Coach Maul doing me wrong. I don't want to hear, I'm a, I'm a lifetime hurricane, played for Coach Maul since four and five, your ass on the bench, because you're not doing your job this year. None of that matters to me anymore. It's about what you do in practice, guys. Do you understand? Now, with that being said, it wasn't the worst day of practice I ever had. But I want you to understand something. Pay attention. Take your job serious. This ain't school. This is football. Coach Maul going to fire you. School can't fire you. I'm going to fire you, my boy. I'm going to fire you. I'm going to send you over there to that bitch, and it's going to be hard for you to come back over there. If you're lucky enough to take somebody's job, don't be dumb to give it back to them, my boy. When you take something, don't give it back. That's my job now. That's my job now. Do you understand me? Yes, All right. I ain't going to hold you all night. Hold on.